Hello friends, this is Umi Sharuna and in this lecture we will see how to create this kind of body uh, with the help of surfacing. So this is our surface exercise. So here we have uh, this top view, one front view and one isometric. See this is the shading view. So I am going to start from the top view. So first of all I will create this uh, 170 radius circle and later I will create this two circle. So let us start with the annex. So, this is very easy exercise, but uh, how to use trim and extend command in this exercise, I am going to tell you. So, first of all, this base circle is 170 and 340 will be the diameter and finish and click here. And before that, I am going to create a new plane, okay, which is a little bit far so uh, 40 plus 15 355 355 okay I select click <clears throat> and next circle we have uh, 170 is a diameter again 170 and these all point make them horizontally align and 225 is this gap and same this is 225 is this gap now finish okay now I am going to extrude this select this one and the 40 is and make sure it is in sheet and both of these two are also 40 and sheet now I am going to match this okay so for surfacing and in surfacing through curve is very important option and so many times we have used this so again this option first is this add second is this and reverse the direction and uh, just change it to sheet and apply okay and if you want to select this parameter and I don't want to preserve see the shape okay again again the same option you can mirror it if you want to mirror you can mirror it otherwise i'm going to match these two okay and make sure it is in surface and it is closed now see here we have to trim this uh, and for this we have this trim and extend option so first surface is this and second surface is this and click reverse the direction and see the result Okay, now I want to join all these surfaces. So we have the sieve. So I'm going to sieve all this sieve. Okay, and thickness of this is 2 mm. So here we have thicken. Select this, and the thickness is inside. Okay. So click it inside and okay. Okay and hide this one. Now if you want to assign any colors, so here we have this view, two shading and so many materials and colors are there. Whatever you want or with the help of this two shading, just select this, drag and select all and apply the texture okay drag and here we have another texture okay so this is the exercise hope you understand this properly thank you for watching